welcome to our channel raptor fishing tackle today uh, we're gonna learn how to uh, put a line over a reel first take a reel and then uh, attach it to the rod via the uh, reel seat over here loosen up the reel seat so that you can fit the reel over here I have specially used a small rod for your demonstration. Yeah. Then we are going to put on the suffix advance line over this reel. This is a 0.35 mm line. Uh, make sure to remove uh, the line from the lock socket of the spool uh, from the spool and then keep the spool down you can uh, take the monofilament line put it under the bail arm over here and by reaching the spool you can put a fisherman's knot of taking both the lines parallel to each other and then holding it with both of your fingers like this parallel to each other and then holding it both your fingers and then twisting it around the line with this part of the line or around the main line five to six times one two three four five after that pass it through the main loop which is there at, on the spool and then the which creates another loop in between it is this loop and pass it through this loop over here and then pull the main line as well as the end of the line together creating a fisherman's knot and then pull it tight i mainly keep the, the knot and the, the thread of the monofilament line in the middle so that it can the reel can start pulling the line from the middle cut off the excess line which is there over the spool then how to spool a line on a reel keep the line in a place where it can easily spool out and then closing the bail arm which I have closed closing the bail arm hold the line with two of your fingers just like this over here two of your fingers so that there is a tension over this uh, reel and it does not uh, spool loosely and then start spooling the line This reel has a capacity of holding 0.30 which is this very line of around 150 meters. So that is what I am gonna do. As I can slowly show you all I have been holding the line and the spool itself is been relieving on its own and it is pulling the line on the reel. The two fingers which I have kept over the line is so that uh, there is a tension over the spool and so that the, uh, the line fits on the spool evenly and there is no overlap or any other different thing or any other abrasion on the spool so that it can hit the line slowly over the spool. While reeling in the spool you should uh, remember that the spool should not be over full so that the line when you throw the line it might get tangled and it can create a bird's nest over the spool so it should be exact on what the recommend the manufacturer has kept over the line
keep checking the spool so that the line is not overfilled over the spool and once you understand that the spool is been filled with the line remember to lock the line on the reel remember to lock the line over the reel which is here and then cut off the extra line which is there on the reel then it is done here it is thank you so much for watching our channel keep watching subscribe and share Thank you so much.